Hello, this video is going to be showing you how to place an event or certify your event with the United Barrel Racing Association. Simply log in to your account. Here. And click login. You can do this right under your Uberry, just your personal account. That is perfectly fine. And once you log in, it is working and this thing's scrolling, so it's thinking about it, registering your information. And then click the events, place an event or edit an event. And then this blue button here says place event. We will click that. And then I am adding a test event, so it's not going to be actual information, you know, for a Uberry event. You can be adding in, you know, your event information. Mine is just for testing purposes, though, so we're just going to do... And I'm going to have it be for May 30th. And it is going to be, if we can select multiple categories here, we're going to go WSA Game Show, Horse Show with Uberry Barrels. And then this default comes in what you have for under your account information. You can add additional email addresses and phone numbers right down here if you want. This can actually be unlimited text. This, this area is used for unlimited text and images. Thanks. And then you can format this however you want to. You can bullet it, make it a lot larger, change the color, do whatever you want here. Um, let's say and then click this link icon. in a new window and then if you want to add an image or a PDF document we can click add media upload from your computer select the file you want <coughs> excuse me I'm gonna check this PDF flyer um, and again it's just a test so it's actually a PDF of a business card and then it will load. Put in our title if you you this is optional, you don't have to or not. going to kind of show you where this information goes. And then leave it at linking to a media file, which is going to be linking to the PDF, and then insert into post. And then on image, it's really only showing the title, and then that is linking into the PDF flyer. If you're going to add an image, 
we will upload a file, select the file, pick an image, The image is loading. You can tell by the little bar here. The image caption. Okay, so now it's loaded. And if you type on this while it is loading, it actually doesn't save it. So we're going to want to redo it. Um, title image title here and then image caption here all tax is more for search engine optimization you know, for show. and then you can keep it so it'll link to a file or you can make it so it custom links to a different url or so it doesn't do anything and then insert into post There, there's the loaded, the image loads and the image captions right here. If you don't add anything in the image caption, it won't have this gray bar feature around the image. Click the director that referred you and then click continue. Here you can add a, four additional images, images only, no PDFs. No Word documents. Otherwise, you can place without any additional images. If you do want to add a new image, you just scroll here. And for this one, I'm just going to put in that image and then upload. So now it's taking time to upload that. Sorry, that must not have been a JPEG ending. Yeah, that was a PNG, so it will only upload JPEGs or GIFs. We'll add this one. And then upload images. Again, you know if it's working and uploading, if this is scrolling. Okay, the file was larger than the maximum allowed, so we'll have to do a smaller image. Again, it's uploading. It's basically pulling the graphic from my computer up to the online version. And then here's just saying your event has been submitted and an email has been sent to the email address you provided with the information you need to edit the listing. Thank you for the URI certification. You can either send a payment via mail to the United Barrel Racing Association LLC, the, the address, or PayPal by sending info at uberry.org your certif cash certification fees. The fees are online here. You The events need to be approved by the admin, the Uberry office before they're activated and online. The admin will not approve them without payments. So I would just copy this link because this is who you're paying through PayPal and then go to PayPal. This is the, the process if you're going to pay through PayPal and not send a check. If you send a check you basically can just put this on your envelope and then send the certification fees that are based on here. But if you're going to pay through PayPal, you log in to your account. 